In this video, we see a young woman working out in the gym, and it quickly becomes apparent that an older man is following her every move in a creepy manner from behind her. If you were a woman who worked out in a gym on a regular basis, watching this video will make your skin crawl. This is yet another video that demonstrates how ladies are unable to exercise in the gym without being gawked at. This woman was stretching, but this strange man came up to her and started making her feel uncomfortable, which is inappropriate and completely unacceptable. Once again, some creepy men being inappropriate at the gym. This weirdo takes it a step further and starts recording a woman working out. The man does this shamelessly, which says a lot about gym culture and general respect for women. I hope he gets banned from that gym for life. He's not in the angle. I asked neighbors about it later and they said that he just moved in with his girlfriend's fam after being released from prison. During one of the hottest days of summer, this girl was recording TikTok videos in her driveway. But things took a turn for the worse when she became aware that a total weirdo was watching her. This YouTuber was enjoying the lovely weather, riding around on his motorcycle when he noticed that someone was following him and it made him feel uncomfortable. Trick seriously doing. What does he want? I don't understand. He's trying to wave me on. Go. I'm old, dude. In this video, a man was driving around in a white truck near some bikers. For some reason, he became enraged with the bikers and followed them around acting like a crazy person. Bring a white truck. They want us dead. Yeah, we need to get the hell out of here. Uh, yeah, go left. Up here. Sorry, I'm taunting them. If they knew something, these aren't dirt bikes. We're on a chase right now. 943, we got a 117. Oh, you're joking, but there's literally an F-150 coming after. <laughs> this guy was just enjoying his day, but at some point he noticed a police officer was following him around for no apparent reason. Thin-skinned group of fucking individuals has took it because, you know, that's part of being a kid. You get shit rolls downhill from bigger and older kids onto you. That's, you, you know, that's just life being a kid. A lot of them were really, really good people that brought around a lot of... Is that a cop behind me? Yeah, I think that's a cop behind me. I think I'm about to get pulled over. The guy's day went from enjoyable to uncomfortable very quickly. We have no idea why he was being followed. In this disturbing video, a woman is driving around while being followed by a stranger. Are you able to see my live location? Yes, I see that currently you're traveling down street at the moment. Is everything okay? Yes, and if anything happens, are you able to notify authorities? Absolutely. I can get the police out to your location right away if you need it. Could you tell me about the situation? Thank you. Um, I, the reason I'm calling is just because I've been driving and there's this person who's been following me kind of aggressively for a while now and I haven't been able to lose them so I'm so sorry that's happening to you today Lauren I know that must be really nervous to have that car following you um, yeah I can stay with you I just want to make sure that you're safe this guy was having a nice day however he discovers that he's being followed by a police officer whose job is supposed to be protect and serve not creep and stalk Caution. 
so he ended up seeing another car going the other direction a little too fast he didn't have any radar on him or anything like that which is just unusual he was blasting me with ka band from uh from behind my car uh while he was following me and uh i didn't go over the speed limit TikTok user Taylor came up with a great idea that will help people determine whether they're being followed or stalked. If you suspect someone is following you around, put your phone in your back pocket with the camera lens exposed and record as you walk. You may be shocked by what you find. Take a look at this TikTok video. It depicts an event with a stalker that took place in the middle of the day. Hey, hey what's going on, man? You got a guy what? following you? Huh? You got a guy following you? Yes. So what's... Well, do you I, know I, why? I have no clue. You have no clue? I am doing my DoorDash. Yeah. This guy is following me. So do you know who he is? Second wife's... Uh, like boyfriend or whatever? Or no, son? no, 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 son. Okay. Oh. You have an order of protection that needs to be served. Is the reason why he's following you. Do you know this weird guy is hey, following you? Warn you well, so we're you. gonna we're gonna take some we're gonna take some action against him Please. because you, yeah. I would not try to make any contact with him because yeah. he he is an offender on an order protection for your mother. So I don't know why you would even try to approach this person. I mean, but he said he's done this in the past and stuff like that, so he does want a ninety-five. Yeah. But yeah, he he definitely needs to go. Yeah. Standpoint here, you can't go stalk someone else to. To serve them. Did those people tell you to stop following him at any point? No, I, I, I mean, I yeah, called him after didn't. the fact. They were told to over there. Today, yes or no? I think he told me to leave. Right? He said to Kevin, you, you understand that the entire conversation is recorded, right? Yeah. Somebody that didn't like you yeah. or started following you everywhere, what would you think about that? It'd probably be unsettling, I guess. Yeah, it'd be very unsettling. That's why you can't, you can't do that. Yeah. All right? Yeah, Makes sense? Sorry. He felt disturbed by you following him. He felt unsettled by you following him. That's not okay. And right. and like my officer, my partner said over here, that is disorderly conduct. That is a a criminal offense. Okay. So I'm gonna be completely honest with you right now. You are under arrest at this point for disorderly yeah. conduct, and you are gonna be mm -hmm. to the police right. department. Okay. Uh, well, move. Uh, sorry, we'll get your car. No, you're you're fine. Could you be careful with my back, my lower back? Yep. yep. My neck is we'll very off. careful. According to this TikTok user. This is the third time that this old man has visited them in an attempt to engage in sexual activity. Okay, I'm right somewhere. You'll have to book in. Okay. Yeah, you see, what time do you like to come back? No, my friend. What do you want? You want sex? Yes. You want sex, you go somewhere else. Don't you read the sign? No, 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 if you want to work sex, you go somewhere else. Hey, don't you read the sign? No. Okay. What's that? <laughs> Hopefully, the authorities deal with this person before somebody gets hurt or worse. A man creepily stared at this woman while she was working out at the gym. Watch this creep come over to my personal bubble while doing our DLS. The gym was practically empty and so many corners to be in and he chose this one. I've been in this corner for 10 minutes before him and only had one set left. So I started recording him so now we're all uncomfortable together. He was literally staring at my Pikachu before this. Once she found out, she was wildly uncomfortable, and I don't blame her. In this TikTok video, the uploader was enjoying a nice ride on his motorcycle. Unfortunately, he eventually noticed someone had been following him for a few hours, which is unsettling. Although not much else is known about this video, the biker is safe. We don't know who the stalker is, but thankfully, no one was harmed. This video shows two women dancing and having fun in the middle of the night, when suddenly, two men approach them from behind. What did these men want? Sadly, we'll never find out. 
This horrible moron was following this woman and her companion around on a bike, asking them if he could show them his genitals. Does mine work pretty? Oh, no, that's not gonna happen. No. No. Nope. Have a nice night. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Have a great night, sir. Then the video cuts off suddenly, although the uploader said that the recording went on for a little while longer. Hopefully, they catch this creep before somebody actually gets hurt or worse. Fancy La Queen uploaded this TikTok video where she confronted the individuals who were stalking her when they were sitting in the car next to her. Hi. Why are you guys? Stay away from us. But why are you here? Stay away from us. I live here. Why are you recording me? Show us the proof. Show us the proof. Show us the proof. We live here. Why are you okay, stalking let's me? Call the cops. Let's call the cops. Okay, call the cops. We will. We will. Call the cops. Okay, ben, call the cops. Go pee too, Ben. Go pee too, and I'll call the cops. No, okay, call the cops. Okay, this is gonna be interesting. I'll nice. park right here. Nice. TikTok user TJ claims the government is following him around and trying to find out what he's doing. Oh shit, there he is. That's the black truck right behind me, guys. There he is. I told you. This is crazy. This is f crazy. I gotta pull over somewhere. Let's just keep it calm. TikTok, don't take my video down, please. Okay guys, so I'm going to actually go into that target right there. Hold on. And I'm just gonna go. So um, I'll give you guys an update in a little bit. It sounds a lot like a conspiracy theory in a way. What would you do if you thought the government was after you? Karma will always find you. And when it does, it tastes just as sweet as justice. Yay. When this TikTok user was browsing the aisles of a store, they became aware of a stranger following them around. Oh, this is crazy. Kick okay, ass in the front. Rather than trying to hide or seeking the assistance of an employee, the uploader chose to follow the stalker around and harass them back. Awesome. Excuse me. Well, you get what you ask for. TJ from the government stalking clip uploaded another video of him being pursued by a trio of black trucks. Now I know I'm not crazy because that dude followed me from home all the way to a Wawa. Like... The events in this man's life seem like something from a movie. Okay, so I did call the cops. They found the guy. The guy denied any involvement. So now the cops think I'm crazy. But this man in that truck right there, right there, followed me. And you guys saw in the last video, 
He was literally watching my house. I don't get it. I'm about to go live in a minute. No fucking way. There's another one right there. Are there any more? Look. Another one. What the f is going on? This isn't good. I'm being followed by three trucks from the looks of it. Three random black trucks are just chilling all in the parking lot as I'm just sitting here. What do you think could be going on with him and the strange videos he's been posting? Do you think the videos are legit? While this TikTok user was setting up her camera to capture some cool dance moves, she became aware that a man on a bike had followed her up and down the street for 15 to 20 minutes. She was just about to start the dance when she realized it, and that must have been horrifying. The following video shows why we should constantly be alert of our surroundings no matter the time of day. I'm sorry. It's <laughs> creepy ass my Yeah, I was just about to say that my not look like He was been following me for a block. Are you serious? Yeah. You can sit this if you want. Yeah, I'll wait till he's gone. Thanks, guys. Yeah, <laughs> oh, my like God. That. He is not, that is not. It was so... The uploader came perilously close to being abducted in broad daylight. On a happy note, though, thanks to her quick thinking, she's still with us today. Sometimes, simply recording what's going on around you may save your life. The uploader noticed they were being followed, so they started recording. This apparently scared the creep out, and they stopped following the uploader right then. These folks were having a nice dinner when they noticed a creepy person stealthily taking photos of them. It's disgusting. They started recording the guy, which prompted him to leave. Someone was able to record a suspicious man following individuals around at a Walmart parking lot. Walmarts are known to get a little weird, but stalking is another matter altogether. This woman was just walking home when she observed a creepy elderly man following behind her with his hands down his pants. She tried to ignore him, but that's still pretty disgusting. This TikTok user was happily chilling in bed when she noticed some creep was watching her from outside her window and ringing her doorbell at 6 a.m. A young lady by the name of Molly uploaded this TikTok video. In it, she reveals that a stalker took pictures of her while walking around campus and then sent them to her. 
What a strange mind game. I hope they catch this creep. Imagine that you're at a store and you discover that a stranger is monitoring your every move. Bro, that person keeps following me. TikTok user Azogi found herself in this exact position late one evening. So, he literally waited for me outside and he is to my right and I'm scared to look. Yeah. Bro, he's fucking staring at me. <laughs> so, basically right now, I drove to a Target because he was following me with his car. Great. Um, and I'm at Target in the parking structure just trying to wait and just looking out, making sure that he didn't see me. Um, yeah, I'm going to drive home and hope for the best, but you guys need to be safe. Um, I had a really shitty day, so this is just this just made it worse like like he literally like waited out for me and followed me with his car like who does that who does that unfortunately the video didn't reveal the stalker regardless let's hope they catch this person before someone gets hurt this individual discovered that they were being followed so they decided to start recording They uploaded this TikTok clip and explained that they wanted to document the situation just to be safe, and I don't blame them. This TikTok user claims that they were filming some entertaining videos in this wonderful forest when they discovered that a strange person was observing them at a distance, which naturally terrified them. The uploader did say that they had some form of protection on them just in case, but thankfully, they weren't forced to use it. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. A man named Danny Tomia recorded videographic evidence of a possible stalker, and he shared it on TikTok. I keep getting that feeling like someone's watching me, and I hate it. You know, it gives me those, like, body chills. Like, I'll be sitting on my computer, and I, like, get that, like, ugh, feeling. And, you know, but there's nobody that lives in these apartments. But I'm trying to, like, see if there's anybody in there. Or they're just empty. You know, and then they're, the lights are completely off, and it's like they're in the shadows just staring at me, walking around like an idiot. You know, it's that, like, tingly feeling in the back of your neck when you, like, know someone's, whoa, shoot, there he is. This TikTok user claims that someone has been following them and staring them down for the past week and they have no idea who the stalker is or what they want. A man by the name of Mike Cope was shooting video of his wife and daughter exercising when he inadvertently caught some jerk staring them down the entire time. It doesn't look like anything came of it, but you have to be really careful at the gym. This woman was working out when she noticed a creepy guy was watching her every move, so she posted this video as proof. While this guy was showing off his muscles and flexing on his TikTok account, he caught an absolute weirdo recording him and uploaded the video. Hey, how you do it? Mate, come out. Why are you including me? I wasn't. Mate. I wasn't. I wasn't. The fuck? 
Yet another woman minding her own business working out at the gym, and this guy stops right in front of her and just stares. <sighs> She continues to focus on her training, but the creep just stands there like it's his job. A man uploaded a video where an unsettling person followed them around and stared at them. Who is this guy and what did he want? It's a puzzle that we will probably never solve. This gentleman uploaded a video showing him on a bench press while a guy near him acted in an odd and agitated manner. The guy took several photos and laughed a few times. Drugs, perhaps? This woman was working out, minding her own business, and was forced to stop mid-workout because a guy was harassing her. She got fed up and threw the weights down, and then the video ended abruptly. Hopefully, she's okay. This woman was in the middle of her set, and this guy tried to take over her space. She asked him to leave her alone several times, and eventually another gym goer had to intervene. The audacity of some of these people is breathtaking. After this creep's two-year protection order expired, she went right up to this person's house and began photographing their unit for some bizarre reason. According to this TikTok user, they ordered a pizza, then mistook the white car in front of their house for the delivery driver. In fact, this mysterious car only departs when the actual delivery person arrives a few moments later. According to the uploader, they asked their neighbors about the occurrence and they were equally perplexed. What do you suppose happened here? A mysterious figure can be seen in this video strolling around this homeowner's backyard at night for no apparent reason. Police is looking for this nigga. Open the next door frame. The next door frame. Oh, I'm all right. Your friend owes me the next door frame. What happens to you think, buddy? Your next door frame. What happens to you think? Your next door frame. Door frame. He owes me the next door frame. I'm right here. I'm not my sister. I'm not my sister. Yep. I'm fine. 
not find him whatsoever. Whenever he was just born, the next door frame, I'm about to do it. Yes, sir. The mama, whatever. Started the new years like this. Fucking new year. Fortunately, the police arrived and dealt with the unusual man. TJ, a TikTok user, tells the camera that he knows there is a stalker in his house and that he wants to do whatever he can to set up his camera and film this creep as evidence. Guys, so I have my camera out right now. There is somebody in my house. After a few moments, the stalker strolls around the house. TJ claims that the police were called, so we can only hope that the creep was dealt with accordingly. Ashanti submitted this terrifying video to her TikTok, which will make you feel uneasy the next time you take public transportation. She claims that from the minute this guy stepped onto the train, he began saying odd things to her, including calling her sexy. He also inquired about her age, birth date, and other oddities. You know, the other one, little Kim Tuck. You better little Kim Tuck. You said what? You better little Kim Tuck. Yeah. So, you're pretty. You're pretty. Yeah, come on. Yeah, I'm cool, thank you. 
you. you have I'm good, thank I'm you. I'm 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 I'
I did not have my phone out when this happened and where I parked, the ring camera didn't pick it up so I couldn't even use it as evidence for anything. But she is trying very hard to make me feel aware of what she is capable of. We're keeping everybody's advice and documenting anything that happens. We'll continue to call the police to file a formal complaint. And of course, we'll keep you guys posted if anything new happens. Part of me wants the girl to find these videos and realize how ridiculous it's just gotten and finally stop. But yeah, thank you guys for all of your help. What would you do if your neighbor was crazy like this? A TikTok user named Jay Swade claims that their neighbor stalks them every night when they get home. The footage is terrifying as we see the neighbor peeking out their window right at Jay. Let's just hope that this neighbor eventually backs off, or if nothing else, the cops get involved. This terrifying security footage shows a suspicious man driving up to this house after midnight and watching it from his car. What was this weirdo thinking? Hopefully, everyone was safe. This terrifying video clip depicts the uploader's stalker neighbor attempting to break into their apartment when they were home alone. Sounds kind of sketchy. A Mesa woman was robbed at gunpoint from just outside her driveway, and authorities are now looking for the perpetrator. To say the least, it was a terrible experience, but Claudette Jones is one brave 84-year-old woman. This vile peeping Tom was recorded by this homeowner's backyard security cameras at night. A lady and her two children were leaving the post office when they noticed a vehicle was following them. Her home security camera captured what happened when she arrived home and parked her car. The mother stops her car in front of the house, gets out, and begins to pull her children out of the car. The car that had followed her home from the post office pulls up next to her and parks in the street. A man emerges and rushes towards her. He threatens her and her children and she offers him money and her watch. The robber re-enters his car and drives away. Fortunately, a witness was able to obtain the vehicle's license plate and reported it to the authorities. The man and another suspect were apprehended by police. Authorities suspect that they were responsible for a number of follow-home robberies in the area. This next creep is so disgusting that he will make your blood boil. According to the police, this man followed a woman home in Lower East Side in March 2017. He allegedly forced his way into her building and tried to rape her. 
A security camera installed outside caught the moment a man stalked a woman before stabbing her. It is truly a dangerous world out there. Always be aware of your surroundings when you're in public, but especially during the night hours. CCTV evidence from the murder of Shane Whitla was released by detectives from the North Ireland Major Investigation Unit. The 39-year-old father of four was discovered in a park in Lurgan on Thursday, January 12th, and was later pronounced dead. When you leave your house to enjoy a fancy restaurant, you're probably not thinking about stalkers or follow-home robberies. It's terrifying to realize that your nice area, restaurants, and affluence won't save you from these criminals. The man in the video sees his world turned upside down when two men stalk him from a restaurant. His face has been blurred for anonymity. When he gets to his door, these two males in black and green hoodies come into sight. They had been waiting for the right opportunity to carry out their nefarious schemes. Fortunately, they failed miserably. This video captures the moment Prince Williams lashes out at a paparazzi photographer for following him and his family around, which, as one might expect, made him feel rather uncomfortable. You can have this altercation. I know, I know. I just realized who it was and I've just... You I didn't, you were out here looking for us. You do Don't I was actually... You do pass us outside our house, I No, I didn't. I haven't been near the house. I've not been... I promise you, I've not been near your house. I'm not going to lie. Yes, you are. No, How not. dare you behave like you've done my children? How I dare have you? not. I have not you done anything. You're stalking around here looking for us and our children. I went for a I'm quiet walk. bike ride with my children That's on a Saturday. Fine. That's fine. And you won't give me your name. You're outrageous. You're disgusting. You really are. How dare you behave like that? And you knew we were coming down here. I didn't know you were coming down here, did I? So where have you come from? I just walked up from my sneak. So why are you here? Yeah, I need you here, Murph. I've had an altercation with a photographer. He's filming me as I'm, as I'm right next to him now. I'm coming down the, um, I'm coming down the... What? Uh, thank you for ruining our day. I moved out of the way so you could get past. You didn't move out I of the did. Way. I, as soon as I saw you, you, didn't. I, you moved, exactly what you were doing. I moved into the you tower. Exactly what you were doing. I thought you guys had learned by now. In August of 2021, Stephen Brenlin uploaded this TikTok video. 
showing this extremely creepy stalker who he claims had pursued him for several weeks. Do you see that? Do you see that? On the phone as well. And how can I be making this up? What? No. 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 Oh my gosh, hang up. So guys, I am not making this up. Do you see that figure? I'm not making this up, okay? He followed him home while pretending to be on the phone with someone, so he doesn't appear to be a stalker. Obviously, no one believed it. In a gas station, a terrified woman flees her alleged kidnapper. He's following her as she dashes inside the convenience store, slammed the door, and quickly deadbolted it. Look at her bare feet and shorts. The heart-stopping escape occurred at a New Jersey gas station following what investigators describe as a year-long nightmare. Jamie Gerthus, a gas station employee, observed her escape. The suspect, James Perillo, 47, fled on a bike but was apprehended two miles away. The woman informed officials that she met Perillo in New Mexico in February 2021 and established a relationship with him. She wanted to leave after a month, and that's when he allegedly began holding her against her will. She said he grabbed her money and credit cards, and they traveled across the country, arriving in New Jersey in December. Bobby Madan, the owner of the gas station, said that she had been at the store days earlier planning her escape. She just got away. She just saw the opportunity and ran. Authorities in New Jersey believe Perillo is a serial predator. Backpacker Magazine stated in 2019 that Perillo was scouring California hiking trails for potential victims. Two women said Perillo imprisoned them for more than a year. In those incidents, he was not charged. At the very least, this woman is finally free. This man decided to record himself after being stalked by his ex. Why do you, why do you stalk me everywhere I go? What's all about? I'm not. You're doing it now? I'll tell you what, I'm never going to Tinder again after this. Come oh, on, guys. Um, look, I need some video evidence of what's going on, right? So I'm on, uh, I'm on my break at work, and I come out of the building, and guess who's behind me? She's stalking me. Can you see it? I'll tell you what, I'm never going to Tinder again after this. She follows me everywhere I go. It's getting a bit weird now. You know what, I didn't mind it at first, it was quite funny. But now, uh, do you know what? I go around this corner, see if she follows me. <laughs> After he followed her home in broad daylight, Jasmine decided to record the strange man with her phone. You're not following me, go home. Go home then. Go home then. If you're not following me, go, leave. Cause you're not leaving me alone, you just tried to follow me home. Walk to your house then. No, I don't want you to see where I live. Leave, go. Listen, you can either leave or I can call the police and tell them that you're trying to follow me. Leave then. Yeah? This man tried to follow me home, across the road there. A couple named Chloe and Matt were out having fun when they were stalked by a suspicious man. I'll walk out without you. Someone has been behind us since the restaurant. I, I just want to get back to the hotel. Let's walk past him. Yeah, yeah. Can you, can you see him? I'm not even kidding. I think I'm about to get into a fist fight. Fortunately, they were unharmed. This person summoned the confidence to face their stalker and tell them to never bother them again. You used to work here? Yes. Mr. Dwyer, I'm a minor. I do not want you to keep coming in here to find me. I don't know who you are. I don't know who you are. All right. All right, sir. According to the Post's description, the cops arrived shortly after and handled the situation. This man confronts a gang stalker 
completely unafraid of him. And as I pull out, a car waiting right here for me. This vehicle is also a gang stalker. They're waiting for me to go somewhere so that they can make their move. What are they doing there? Why are they waiting there? It's illegal to wait for someone at a point and observe them and wait for them to leave. Does this guy not know that? What's up, man? What's up? Have I seen you before, dude? Maybe. At Stingers, maybe. Stingers? Yeah. Really? How do you know I go to Stingers? Because I go to Stingers. Okay. That's interesting. Yeah, what's up? Not much, man. The is fucking close. Yeah, it sucks. It's not bad, man. Yeah. Yeah, you have a great night, dude. What's up? Have a great night. You too, man. The stalker claims to know the uploader from a pub he only visited twice in the past five years. And did you see how that dude instantly, like, that, that was interesting. That requires analysis right there, okay? The dude didn't seem concerned that I was rolling up to him as a complete stranger, asking him, like, do I know you? And immediately, he fucking does. The guy does know me. Like, <laughs> the guy does know me. Okay? So, like, these people, what are the fucking odds of that shit? It rolls off his mouth the second I fucking say it. See, a lot of times even my mind is blown when I get, when I find out, you know, how they're reacting to shit. That was, uh, huh. That was very interesting. And he instantly tries to change the subject. Oh, hey, what's up? What's going on? First of all, Stingers? Dude, I've been to Stingers fucking twice in my life. Literally, twice in my life. I was thinking about going there like two weekends ago on a Saturday night. So I put it in my phone. Last weekend I was thinking about going there. So I put stingers in my phone to see how far away from us. I didn't end up going. These people, they track you. They find out everything about your life. And they use it against you. I rolled up on that dude out of nowhere. And what are the odds? He knows 